Hey, Weird Fam, this is Leo. This is, let's see, Vlogmas Day. Gosh, I don't even know, 14? Anyway, it's the Monday after we came back from the weekend, but this is not the time to be on a diet because teachers do this kind of thing. They leave a cake, a whole cake and cake pops in the teacher's lounge for anybody to grab. I was just sitting there, so I got that. <laughs> I'm gonna snack on that, it's probably gonna be my lunch. And I got these two gifts from um, two of my students. So one of my students came by and gave me this, and I had some candy in it, but guess what? I already ate it. And then sunshine and lemons, foaming hand soap. So that was really sweet. Usually it's the main teachers that get gifts, and we just get, you know, nothing. And then I got this. I'm going to open it and show you what's in it because I don't know yet. But isn't this cute that this is a um, student that created this little thank you here. And since I teach math, he put a bunch of math stuff on there. <laughs> oh, so cute. All right, so I'm going to open this and tell you what's inside. All right, so I opened up my little package. And what is in here? It says... Ding bowl, which I've never heard of before, but look at this. This is so cute. It's got, it's ceramic. So it's like, really like glass, you know, ceramic. And it's a bowl that is on a little a stand and it's got a top that goes on here to keep your food warm. So, and when you put it on there, it makes little circles right here. So I guess you can just carry it, you know, like this. That is really cute. So if you had like your lunch or something in there, you could keep it warm. That is an awesome gift. I really like that. It's very unique and um, very useful. So thank you to the student that gave me that. Vlogmas Day 15. As you can see, um, <laughs> if you recognize this in the background, if you do anything with editing, this is my editing software here. So I am editing Vlogmas Day 13 right now, which was supposed to be posted yesterday. I'm still editing it and I'm going to release it today. I still have to also edit and release Vlogmas Day 14 tonight, I guess. And now I'm filming for Vlogmas Day 15 that hopefully will be posted tomorrow. But I just went to my, um, you know, my box. I had three cards in there. And if you don't recognize the names, well, I go by Leo. That is my, I guess you could say my family name or my nickname. And um, friends and family call me that, but my, my given name is Laurie, so legally. And so somebody got my real name right my real name and then before i got married i was mrs bennett and so some of my students that i've had for several years um they resist change and so they don't like the fact that my name is different <laughs> so they just continue to call me miss bennett actually they say miss bennett because that's the way they pronounce it so i'm gonna open these cards and see what i got okay so i opened up my cards so this is a christmas card from one of my co-workers this is a card from my <clears throat> from my department chair 
And I think that is actually her, I don't know if that's her dog, but she has a dog just like that. And um, she, I think she has two dogs like that and she's obsessed. Like she takes them to doggy daycare and watches them on the video screen and like, just like a little kid, it's hilarious. Anyway, she says, um, uh, Merry Christmas, good luck, we will miss you. So that's really nice. Cause you know, they just found out that I'm leaving a couple of days ago. And this one is very sweet. Happy Paula days. I don't know if I want to open this for the name. Hold on, let me um, let me cover up the name of the student and um, show you what they wrote. All right, we are back. So uh, I'm sure this was written by the mother because, um, well, it's in third person and plus his handwriting. This kid's handwriting is um, it's typical for you know. <laughs> for a kid on the spectrum, but a warm fuzzy wishes for a furry merry holiday season and it says thank you for helping Alex this year and last year and the year before that. As I said, some of my students have had now for three years in math. So um, really nice kid, very, very sweet. Um, and um, he also, I'm sorry, so they gave me this card that was very nice and also target gift card for five bucks yeah so um that's exciting i will stick that in my wallet it's very very sweet when you get gifts and things from uh you know from your students especially with um students with disabilities because they don't always think about others the way that um typical children do and so when they think about you enough to give you something like this um, it really means a lot. It's very special. So, are you kidding me? So we, <laughs> just be she gathering, to roast gathering hot sticks from roast hot dogs. I mean, from getting ready to roast hot dogs, Dallas is supposed to be gathering sticks. First, she said, "Use what, Dallas? Pine straw. Use pine straw." <laughs> and the the fire's not getting very very far, very fast either. So we've got to we've got to help it along a little bit. And then Carter. <laughs> Carter is trying to open that. I told dog. you which corner to open it. <laughs> I tried that corner, it just doesn't, I, I can't do it. If you knew which corner, why didn't you just do it yourself? Because I suck. <laughs> All right, well, Sadie, you're having a nice, you where's Sadie? Sadie? Where's Sadie Sade? Next to the Sade, where is she? Sadie, where? <laughs> oh, I see her eyes glowing. All right, so the fire got a little bit, uh, <laughs> You might have to cut the I think we missed it. We'll pretend like we didn't hear whatever it was you said, but they're getting, it's the fire's so... lit up a little bit. Whoa. My contacts are gonna like dry out of my face. They're going to be glued to your eyeballs. Oh, that's and the beauty of living in the, in the country. Drag racing. <laughs> you can stick it in the, uh, you'll have to, I'll have to hold the, bowl because if you put it on the ground Sadie will eat it. Where is Sadie? There she is. Hi girl. All you see is her eyes glowing in the... <laughs> Sadie, wait It's hot over here. Be careful. Yeah, you cannot see that at all. I Sorry, it's too dark. Want a hot dog. Yeah. Well. Like if I sit. Uh, that's Rubik's race. Climbing siblings. The loser versus the loser. Flight race to the bottom. Dallas won, I won. Now they're duking it out for third place. <laughs> nah. I didn't think this would be a long video, but uh. Oh! Wrong. Try again. Check and make sure it's right. It's right. Oh, man. Braylon, you need to take this game. <laughs> you need to take this game home and practice. She wants play, a rematch. Dallas wants to play too, so. Okay. <laughs> now it's girls versus girls. to get a video of us spread this morning. Uh, but they, you know, we did the potluck where we fed ourselves. So this is my plate of all kinds of little bit of everything. 
and um, I was supposed to bring pigs in a blanket and I got all the stuff to make it last night and my oven is broken so I could not bake anything and so I brought nothing so I'm, I'm a moocher today did not contribute but I'm sure taking because there's gonna be plenty of leftovers anyway and so I took this plate happy vlogmas day 16 So there's a very Christmassy vehicle right there. It's a Jeep with the uh, the tire is a wreath and it's got sparkly lights on it. So isn't that cute? Vlogmas Day can't can't remember. <laughs> hey Wed fam, it's Leo, one happy widow. This is some Vlogmas, but I I don't. I don't know when it's going to be posted, and I don't know which day it's going to be with. Probably 18. I haven't posted Vlogmas in a couple of days because I've been so busy at work. So what I'm going to do is just put like three days of Vlogmas together into one post. And I'll just post that as soon as I get a chance, hopefully this weekend. But um, I wanted to, I have so much to talk about and so much to say right now about what's going on, but I don't have the time to talk about it. So I'll have to do that later. But um, the reason why I want to say this right now is because I want to document this. I, I'm sitting in my car. I'm about to go into the building of my job and it's the last day of work for me um, in a building. Like it's my, it's the last day before Christmas break. It's the last day probably that I will ever teach in person again. Um, I'm, you know, I'm trying to get out of the teaching field. I'm right now just about to make a transition from teaching in the building to teaching at home online. So I'm switching jobs, right? Um, and so today I'm about to enter the school probably for the last time. I know for this school, probably any school as a teacher for the last time for the rest of my life. So, um, and you know, what's really sad is that I hope people don't have to look at this video later on and say, wow. That's so weird that she called that, but like today, I don't want to say any keywords that will like trigger the YouTube algorithm to, you know, like say something bad about my video. So I'm going to not use specific words and terms, but there's a social media app out there that's really popular, especially with the young kids that's been encouraging kids to do things um, that they should not be doing. And today which today is technically December 17th. They have labeled this something to do, you know, with schools. And they have are trying to encourage um, young people to do some acts and some things that are terrible today. Um, and so I told my husband and my sister, my sister's a teacher also, and I thought, you know, wouldn't that be some shit if <laughs> the last day that I ever teach in a building that something really bad happens and it ends up being the last day of my life <laughs> like I don't want to use like I said I don't want to use those terms but I think you know what I'm talking about but like I just don't want to go down in history like that you know like how ironic was it her last day ever and um, and she never made it out of the building <laughs> so you know I just had to put it out there um, you know just in hindsight but um, Again, my last day, and it's a Friday, and it's the last day before, you know, as kids get out, they're taking the final exam. Most of the kids will be gone halfway through the day. I have to collect my things, and what am I about to do? Go in and have a meeting, an IEP meeting on my last day, because they don't want to push all of my work onto other um, workers after I've left. So, that's another rant for another time, but um, anyway, I'm about to head into the building for my last day of school. Um, so wish me luck and hopefully I'll have another post after this that says I made it out alive um, anyway I'm going uh, I'm going in now and um, after today I'm free all right you guys have a good one vlogmas day I don't know, 18 I guess we'll call it 18 Merry Christmas and um, here we go I'm going in well, about seven years ago, I walked through the front door at a different school in this county to start the last leg of my teaching career in the building. I took a picture on that day when I walked in. And now today is the last day that I'm walking out of the building in this county.
for the last time. You can't really see the sign because I'm in the back of the school, but this is it for me. I'm about to walk through those doors for the last time and uh, fill up my box with the rest of my stuff from my desk, and then I'm out of here. So uh, it's the end of a of a um, of an era in my life, and the end of a next of one phase. And God's closing this door, and He's going to open some other door for me on down the road. So it's time to start something new. So, as you can see, we're getting ready to paint. This wall is horrible. And to be honest, on the on the camera, it actually looks like a tannish brown, but it's really more like of a yellow color in real life. And it's horrible. There's some kind of mark there. I don't know, that's from the leftover people. So this is where I film. And so we're getting ready to paint these two walls and make it look nicer. And it's done. I did not think it was gonna come out very good because of the fluorescent lighting. It does look a little more gray in real life than it does on the camera, but we painted over and we did these two walls. It looks fantastic. That is Sherwin-Williams agreeable gray. Our entire house at the other house was this same color, but on top of that yellow, I was worried. When it was wet, it was looking not very good. So, but now it looks much better. I love it. Now it's time to film. You can see, okay, there we go. You can see what color it was before, that awful yellow. All this awful yellow here, and now this. Much better. I like it. Hey, Wood fam. I don't know why my face looks so red right now. It doesn't really look that way in the mirror. Anyway. Um, I'm on my way to get my hair updated. So this is like a before and after. <clears throat> I didn't actually fix it. It's clean and just blow dried, but I didn't want to put any product in it, like or any heat or anything, cause I'm going to get it major colored and major cut. So you can see how it's like, I don't know. It's just like a mousy brown color. It's really thin and, um, it's flopping, flipping out over here and, just this thing. I don't know what to do with that. Tuck it. Tuck it. There we go. I'm gonna look nerdy. Um, so when I update, I will have new color and new cut. I don't know if I can get the back. Let's see. How do you do that? Uh, hmm, I don't think that's working. All right, let's see if I can do it this way. Oh, there we go. Can you see that? I'm going to squat down a little bit. There we go. There. Can you see the back? There. Let me see if we can shave that a little bit. Oh, and I got my new Christmas glasses on. So, uh, a little snowman. See how they, uh, just bloop, pop on. So I can change out the style for the time of year. Okay, off, off with the old off with the old, on with the day. See ya. All right, I'm done. Just got back from my hair place. Uh, let's see if you can see the difference. Got lighter, got shorter, got a lot shorter over here. Mm -hmm. I changed my glasses too. Let's see. Can you see in the back? Yeah, I definitely got shorter in the back. Uh, I feel so much more Precious so clean, clean, yeah. So, <sighs> yay, feel better.